You typically don't get rich working in retail or in restaurants. And now these hourly wage workers are kind of like the mask police forced to act like parents <laughs> while customers act like kids melting down over masks. I don't, I don't have a mask. I don't have a mask. This new video posted on Facebook is from a Fort Worth 7 Eleven. You're not going to sell me this? A woman cussing at and arguing with the cashier who told her she needed to have on a mask. I'm not paying for a the store told me they couldn't legally discuss what happened here, but it continues to happen. In the state of Texas, businesses, which means employees, bear the burden of enforcing local mask ordinances. Our retail business is not in the business of denying service to anybody. That's not what we're used to doing. Stores can be fined if customers violate their policies, but those customers keep claiming masks violate their freedom. Not wearing a mask is infringing on my freedom and my liberty. The Speaker of the Texas House, a staunch conservative, has been pro-mask for months. On WFAA's Inside Texas Politics, he said people who refuse to wear them infuriate him. It's not the fault of the store that we have this COVID situation. These clerks didn't make the rules. I'm not the least we could do is respect them. We have a right in America not to wear a mask. Have you not watched the news? In Dallas. We don't have to do this. I'm Teresa Woodard.